here at the Hyundai Fan Zone. Flavs with me, the truce is still on. It's the on, mate, it's on. Huh? I'm, I'm, are you feeling about it, all right? Yeah, it's a bit of an uneasy truce at the moment, but listen, it's England, I'm behind England. You see Ian Wright in a cane shirt earlier. He saw that in Instagram. Ian Wright in a cane shirt? Yep, absolutely. No, I ain't having that, I ain't having that. Uh, but, check his Instagram. <laughs> but listen, um, looking forward to it. I am, I'm nervous. I'm, I'm, I, look, we, we showed enough in the first game to, 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 to be, be able to beat Wales. We're, we're good enough, we're, we're, we're young, exciting, forward-thinking, and... Um, uh, it's a different type of England. It feels different. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I agree with you. I Wales, agree. Wales were uh, they were decent. They were okay, and you know, Slovakia are, are, are no mugs. But I think we've got enough to beat them. I'm really confident. I was confident after the Russia game, and I'm, I'm confident now. One contentious thing at the moment: yeah. Should Harry Kane be starting? I want you to be completely neutral now, right? Should he be starting? I reckon we should have started with Vardy. Is that contentious? It's not, it's not even it a talking point. He didn't play well in the first game. He didn't play well. But why does he keep taking all corners and all that as well? Well, that's nothing to do with him. He's doing what he's told. But, he, <laughs> you know, it is a bit of a weird one with Sterling in the box when he's like a midget, isn't he? And uh, Kane should be in the box, really. But, mm. look, Harry Kane, you know, everyone knows how good he is. It's not even a Tottenham thing. You know, we need him playing yeah, up front. Baller. He's a better footballer than, uh, than Vardy is, although... Uh, I'd probably play them both up top, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to see how they both work together, use Vardy's pace. Uh, uh, Kane's intellect to uh, to make sure we carve him open, but you know if, if Kane's dropped, he's dropped. I think Vardy's good enough to fill his boots. Right, listen, we're going to get into it. The game's about to kick off in about the next ten minutes. Looking forward to it. We got to win this. It's got to do this for England, but the Welsh are confident. Gareth Bell, Aaron Ramsey, they got a good team. It's going to be a proper game. Wales just scored Bell 30 yards. Should have done better, Rob. What do you think? Yeah, terrible, it's an easy save for Joe Hart, I can't believe he let that in. And England in general have been awful that half, I mean, I don't think Wales are that great. I mean, they didn't. that was about the only thing they, they did in that half. Sterling had that easy chance that he fluffed. But I just think that England, they're just too slow. It's just, they, I think, they, they, where, where's the, the, the pace in the team? It's just all too slow. I think Wales are sitting quite deep, it's making it difficult to play against. They're trying to contain, get the ball out to bow. We know we knew that that was going to happen. and he, Hodgson should have planned against that. I think for the uh, you know the last 20 minutes, bar the goal, England were coming into it. We had a couple of decent half chances, but Wales did their job well. They were they were nasty in the tackle. They broke up play well. They got the ball to bail, and when he got the ball, he used it properly. What our forwards were doing were, were being wasteful. Sterling again has been uh, horrendous in my opinion. Well, you, you know what? Right now, Roy Hodgson's got to earn his money. Right, what is he going to do in the second half? We need to win this game. Yeah. You know, I mean, a draw wouldn't be the end of the world because then we could go into the last game against Slovakia, try and get a win. But we need to win this game. I still feel we need to win this game. What is Roy Hodgson going to do? Is he going to bring on Sturridge? Is he going to bring on Jack Wilshere? Is he going to bring on Vardy? What will he do? You know, and that is going to be the interesting thing for me to see if this manager is any good. Uh, Kane isolated again. Yeah, Kane's been very poor as well. I, I don't know, just in general, the whole team for me has just not played to the level. They played much better against Russia. Um, but tonight, today, they've been, they've been awful. Yeah, it's a gutting feeling. Just coming into it very confident. And, you know, this is football. If we're going to win this competition, we've got to be beaten, Bale. We'll go. We'll go. Anyway, we'll see how this second half goes. Let's start, Rob. Come on. Do it.
a goal. You know, by Sturridge. Unbelievable. We did it. We, I just can't believe that's just happened. I've never felt this way about England ever in my life. When that ball came through, when uh, the Sturridge played the ball into uh, 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 Rivardi, I think, played it back into him. He went through the box, slotted it into the bottom corner, and this place just went mental. Listen it's to me. Get it home. It's coming. Football's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming home. Mate. Hey, you know what? I've got to give it out to Roy Hodgson. I said at half time, yeah. will he be brave enough well, to make the right changes? And he was. Yeah. Rashford, yes. Sturridge, Vardy. Well done. I'm, you know what? I'm one of his biggest critics, but I am pleased with Roy Hodgson. That was an amazing substitution. Yeah, he got it wrong at the start, but it don't matter. He came on at half time. Uh, he came at half time. So, uh, Vardy, um, Sturridge, you brought in, took off an ineffectual cane. And, and, and stats. Listen, let's just have a party, man. Come on! Amazing. Amazing.